Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we are watching the Star Wars Squadron's official singer, sing, bleh, single player review uh, preview. It's fine, I'll get it right at some point. Um, and I'm really, really excited because I am super, super hyped for this game, as I'm sure you guys are too. Um, so getting a little bit more content, seeing a little bit more of a preview of this, I'm so excited. Um, I did react to the original trailer as well, which is also in my somewhere down in my channel that you'll be able to find that. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. I'm really, really excited. We all choose our path. Light Leia! or dark. Freedom or destruction. Alderaan, no! The Empire chose oh. to destroy Alderaan in order to spread fear and douse the fires of rebellion. But the heroic pilots of the Rebel Alliance have chosen to keep fighting. I have goosebumps. To show the Empire that we are not afraid. It was their bravery that ended Palpatine's reign and brought about our new republic. <laughs> However, the Empire ah! lives on, shattered though it may be. As I speak, Imperial forces are edging toward the Bormia sector, hoping to end our new republic before we find our footing. As their empire collapses, they try to tighten their grip. But the galaxy is changing, and you can be a part of it. With the help of brave and daring pilots, oh, that's such a beautiful this war shot. can end. Oh my Make god! Ah! With the new Republic, change our galaxy for the better. Why am I getting emotion? Why do I feel like I... Hi, I'm Suzanne Hunka, narrative producer on Star Wars Squadrons. I feel Our emotional. Our single player story is one of daring pilots and deep-seated rivalries. Take Titan Squadron, hunt down this Starhawk, and eliminate it. Gladly, Admiral Sloane. It is Sloane. Over the course of the story, you'll fly as two pilots on opposite sides of the war. And, like all modes in Star Wars Squadrons, you'll have the option that to experience sky. every mission fully immersed in Looks VR. Looks so beautiful! Wedge! Wedgie boy! You're the reason I was able to finally get a calm through. Today, we're giving you a glimpse Whoa. of an early Imperial mission behind enemy lines. One of our spies, Agent Thorne, has discovered vital intelligence on Project Starhawk. Your mission is to extract her from an orbital outpost above Hosni and Prime. Behind enemy lines, you'll have to eliminate perimeter defenses. The outpost is defenseless. When you oh secure the area, you will escort the Gladius to the outpost, and our extraction team will acquire Agent Thorn. Once Thorn is secure, reach your Gozanti cruisers and return to the Overseer. Cover our escape and escort us to the jump point. We have Republic Corvettes inbound. Move, Titan! Oh, this is gonna be so much fun! Titan Three, take out those fighters. Understood. I'll handle it. You have my thanks, Titan Squadron. No time to celebrate. I'm still feeling emotional. I don't know why. Each mission will immerse you into the escalating conflict between the New Republic and a shattered empire. Debrief with your squad mates between missions. You're our new wingmate. Customize and master all eight starfighters and join the galaxy's finest. That's what finest. we love to I hear. I you focused and ready to go. <laughs> she looks so pretty! From bombing runs at the Nadiri dockyards <laughs> to setting a trap in the Xavian Abyss. The story of these rival squadrons will push the war to the brink and define the galaxy for years to come. I look forward to seeing you in combat October 2nd. My goodness! Oh! No, I don't want Clone Wars trailer. Don't make me depressed. Oh, oh man, I am, I am incredibly, incredibly excited to play this game. I am just waiting, waiting for it to be released. And we've only got like a month or so to wait, so it's not that long. But I am really excited. I'm gonna get myself a VR headset so that I can play this as well. Um, I um, oh, gosh, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be so freaking good. And the trailer just, it just looks really nice. The graphics look beautiful. Everything about it just looks great. Um, and I'm really excited to see what other missions. Obviously, they gave us a little teaser of one of the missions. And I'm excited to see what other missions we get. And I'm excited to switch between both sides as well. Because you do get to play, you know, you, you do get to play on both sides. So um, I am very excited to see how the X-Wings fly, how the TIE Fighters fly, which I'm going to prefer. I'm going to say TIE Fighters because, you know, that's the side that I'm on. 
Um, but I'm I think it's gonna be great. And I just would like to point out Look how good she looks. Look at her. This is like this is one of the biggest things in this game for me is having Hera in this game. I adore like I I really love Rebels. I know it's kind of a touchy subject to some people, but I freaking adore it so much. And Hera is probably one of my favorite characters. And I it's really, really nice to have representation of her in a game. You know, we don't you don't get to see that kind of stuff. I want to see her in more because she doesn't get, you know, she just she's just underused she needs more she needs more screen times so i'm really glad to see her in this and this actually this design actually looks more like her comic design um in the dr afra comics there's a section where dr afra spoilers for anyone who hasn't read the dr afra comics it's not a big spoiler but just in case um there's part in the dr afra comics where afra um oh what have i done i have scrolled in full screen that is not something i thought was possible um Anyway, yeah, Dr. Alpha captures uh, Hera, and this looks very, very similar to that design. Let me find a picture, actually. Okay, so this this is this is Hera in the Dr. Alpha comic. Like, you can see what I mean by the design. Obviously, obviously Rebels is a very, very different design to anything. Uh, the animation design is completely different in that, so it's understandable, but she so reminds me of the comic version, and that makes me really, really happy. Makes me really happy to see. Um... Because I'm a little bit obsessed with the comics, so yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you guys are excited, as excited for this as I am, uh, because I know I am just waiting for this to be released. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe for more Star Wars content, and I'll see you soon. So peace!